And if you are watching on the recording, which I just started, uh, go follow my Twitch channel and subscribe. So let's go ahead and get started. We're going to be playing as Steve because it's Steve. Everyone loves Steve. Uh, I've already played Minecraft Engines before, quite a bit of it. I already I have a couple other profiles. But we're going to be starting fresh again. <laughs> for the fourth or f for the fourth or fifth time now. <laughs> so let's just go ahead. The village is burning. No doubt this is the work of the evil arch Illager and his minions. They sweep across the land like a ravenous scourge, subjugating or destroying all in their path. This is a time for heroes like yourself. Make haste. The villagers have need of you. Minecraft Dungeons Pog, yes. Alright, I gotta turn up the sound. Let's, let's do like 50. It should be. Alright. So, if you don't know what Minecraft Dungeons is, it is a separate game developed by Bojang. And, uh, it's an, RP it's an RPG game made by them. Uh, they were inspired by dungeon crawlers, so they made Minecraft Dungeons. And in this game, there is a story going on with um, this character called the Arch Illager. And we have to go, and he's been... He was betrayed by villagers, and he found this thing called the Orb of Dominance. I don't know why it didn't show- there was a whole cutscene, but it didn't show it for some reason. But he finds this thing called the Orb of Dominance, and we're actually going to see him right here. Um, this is Archie, that's the Orb of Dominance. And he's the king of the Illagers. And he's- Clearly, this village is burning, so he's been uh, causing chaos to all villagers and just the whole Minecraft world. So we're here to stop him. Oh, and right here, I just got an artifact and an enchantment point so I can enchant my sword with something like Prospector. Now I get more emeralds when I defeat a mob. So... I just use the firework rocket. Oh, and you have this roll ability, and you can roll across gaps like that. Here you go. You were too late to rescue the villagers, but don't fret. They're still out there somewhere waiting for a hero to find them. Alright, so we missed the villagers, and now we need to go save them. 
But now we have a campsite. All right, and we just got a fishing rod. So now we're gonna fishing rod PVP some people. Uh, raid captains. If you defeat a raid captain, you collect the banner and there's a random, uh, what's it called? There's a random uh, side effect applied to your mission and it makes it a lot harder, but you also get more rewards at the end. This is a battle pass. Um, I just, there you go, look at that. Um, oh, this is the tower over here. Um, you basically just get to, you battle floor after floor after floor, and every, and every ten floors you battle a boss. Uh, for each boss that you defeat, you get to keep a weapon. Um, and every four you just get a random so it, it's basically a separate adventure from the campaign which is cool so we are gonna go to creeper woods and I forgot to equip my fishing rod uh, I still have it in my inventory, so I'll just pick it up. By the Arch Illager's decree, all free folk are now enemies of the Illager Empire. Somewhere in these woods, a caravan is transporting villager prisoners to labor in far off lands. Find the caravan and stop the Illagers. Well, there's no telling what dreadful doom will befall our villager friends. The music in this game is amazing. <laughs> so now I'm gonna fishing rod PvP some zombies. I missed. <laughs> there we go. So you left click to move around and you click on the enemies, and then you hold right-click, draw your bow. Those little pots have emeralds in them. Uh, we need to get some armor because in this game armor gives you health instead of defense for some reason. So there you go, we just saved a villager. In this game you can just explore wherever you want. Like, if we go back here, uh, yeah, we can go back here, we go up here, jump over here, look at that. Oh, and I just got a better bow, so let's equip that. Uh, this has... Fuse shot. Mm, can't do anything yet. And I think if we go up here. There should be. Oh, look at that. Fighting an Enderman now. Look how much damage he does. There we go. And you can press E to 
drink health potion. And I think over here, we have a little secret area. Inside this cave, I believe there is. Oh, look at that. I believe there is an Eye of Ender. And. Basically, there was a bunch of Endermen that stole Eyes of Ender from the End Portal, and we need to go retrieve it. Again, there's a cutscene for that, too, but. It just won't play. <laughs> Actually, I'm not sure when exactly it plays. Oh, see, look at that. I almost died. And this sword has... There you go. Committed. And we can salvage this to get an enchantment point back. We can get fuse shot. Oh, <laughs> just got launched off. I, I forgot, if you walk through the mushrooms, they'll make noises. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Uh, let's grab a firework rocket. There you go. down there. Look at that. Right there. That's some, I think, void. <laughs> Those are like void blocks. Um, we got another bow or something. <laughs> I don't I don't have armor. I don't, I'm not sure if I'm ready for this. Yeah, I'm not ready. We're gonna have to use a bunch of arrows. Oh, shoot. Mmm. Bad. Oh no, this is really bad. This is really bad. Uh, this is really, really bad. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Alright, we have totems though. It's, we're fine. Oh, wait. Okay. Whoa! Alright, so there, yeah, we got an Eye of Ender. Hawk brand gives critical hit chance. All right, that's it's better because critical hit is just amazing. And we are can't get any achievements. <laughs> and up here is the chest. Look at that. All right, now we can continue with our regular mission. Uh, 
Oh, um... Never mind, we can't continue yet because we need to go grab a secret over here. Uh, you see this right here? This is this is not an entrance, this is an exit. So we need to find the entrance. And the entrance, I think, is just over here. So this is how, by the way, all of these maps are randomly generated. So you're never going to get the same map twice. They they do feel like I can still tell where stuff is because there's still structure to it. But this corner right here maybe wouldn't have would have been in a different place or it wouldn't have been there. So the scenarios change, but the strategy like overall is different. Well, the strat no the strategy overall is the same. The scenarios are much different. Uh, here we go, there's the entrance, so we're just we're gonna press the button. And by the way, that's like a that that needs to be uh, there's so many things in Minecraft dungeons that I think really should be in regular Minecraft. Like, the combat in general. See, look at this. We got a map. Is that a circle? That's... We're not gonna talk about the circle map. Uh-oh. And there we go. Oh, finally. Armor. We're gonna explore this a little bit, and then we'll go back to saving the villagers. Yeah, there's not much to explore, to be honest. That's the entire map. Let's just head out now. See, so look, now we exit here. And now we're gonna go save villagers. Spin attack move. Um, no. All right, here's a, here's another here's another mm -hmm. secret area. Creeper cavern. Creeper dungeon. Oh, and right over here we have good old villager friend. Um, so this is actually, this villager is special. None of the other villagers really matter. Um, only this villager does. He is a shopkeeper. He's the village merchant, and he's gonna go to our home base, and we'll be able to buy stuff from him. If you're really good at this game, you can dodge pretty much every 
skeleton arrow, but you have the you have the health to tank it, really. So there's not much point other than just maybe a damageless run. I could do that, that might be fun. You can kill all the. <laughs> oh, you see that like skull thing that appears? That's the critical hit. Why am Why am I critical hitting? Why am I critting out cows? Oh yeah, sheep drop pork in this game. They drop apples too, I guess. Another house we can go into. You just gotta escape. ghost so that's what the uh, the purple potion does you pick it up and you become a ghost and you do like triple or double the amount of damage just, just for one hit though
creatures are free from the clasp of the illagers. All thanks to you. I muted myself. <laughs> I pressed my mute button by accident. Oh, tasty bone. Okay, we got a dog now. Attack and movement speed. Pets deal more damage. So, so this wolf armor, when you drink the health potion, it um, it like disperses the healing to your to the to your allies as well. I can't talk. <laughs> it says right here. Heal, uh, heal potions, health potions heal nearby allies. So wolf armor is pretty cool. Pretty cool. Um, it works on your pets as well. So we're going to use um, this one. Pets deal more damage. Um, and there we go. Oh, let's actually talk to the village merchant. That is floating. <laughs> that is, oh, what? I kind of want a new artifact, because I'm going to be honest, I don't really like the... The fishing rod all that much. I don't know. We're not going to buy anything right now. Let's just go to... We've done Creeper Woods. Let's... Okay. What should we do? Cacti, canyon, soggy swamp, pumpkin pastures, or redstone mines. Uh, let's do redstone mines. of the overworld. Whispered rumors say the Illagers are building something dreadful far beneath these ancient mines. Something of soot, metal, and flame. Only a hero such as yourself could brave the cavernous underground and uncover the truth. All right. Redstone mines. We have to locate villagers left behind. Oh, wait. Uh, please. I want a minecart to come through here and hit that creeper. Never mind. Let's see. Come on. So, look, that thing. Yeah, it'll hit you. And deal damage. That creeper took two hits. Alright, this is... So creepers used to take one hit, but now they take two hits. I forgot I have a dog. Oh, evoker. I just got wooloo'd. But that's what the song will say. They'll say wooloo'.
Oh, my dog died. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> See, oh, that, that zombie just got killed by the minecart. Supplies. Free, you're free. They just teleport. It's like, you couldn't teleport before? Oh. I have to kill the enchanter. Those villagers. Ooh. Ooh, we just got the harvester. Harvester is a really good artifact. That was a terrible firework rocket. I just realized my bow has fuse shot. Kind of, why did I throw a TNT at that single spider? That was kind of dumb. <laughs> okay, what is over here? What do I need over here? Ow, I'm, that was dumb. <laughs> See, I think I just healed the dog, but, wow. All of my health is gone. <laughs> my dog just killed both. My dog can kill the creepers faster than I can. Enchantment point. So every time you level up, you get an enchantment point, and you can use it on a weapon or armor. That was dumb. So I know this is redstone right here, but what is this? Are these diamonds? Like, what are they? Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Alright, my dog almost died. Okay, 
guess. So I can call the dog over <laughs> if I didn't want it to... I didn't want him to take damage, so I called him over. Oh, that's another evoker. Alright, well, let's just... That's a lot of damage! Mm -mm. Alright, we're going... We're gonna go back over here. Ooh. Just got the corrupt beacon. Alright, there you go. Uh, that's how you kill the the arch. Uh oh. Come on, I just fought a bo Okay, we're not gonna go there yet. We are going to put on this armor. And we are gonna. Fire tr no. Yeah, fire trail. I want to grab Echo. Right, look at all. Let's see, I've been playing this for like 30 minutes now, and I already have all of these items. <laughs> Uh, we're going to use the harvester, and actually that won't help us. There go. Hey, Archie. Alright, so we're gonna run. And that's how you deal with your enemies fast. <laughs> and that's also how you step into lava. And now we're gonna go over here and save this guy, the blacksmith. So the blacksmith is insanely good because he'll upgrade your weapons. Uh, so the rumors are true. The Illagers are building a dreadful forge so under the mountain. Yeah, so instead of having to select a new weapon to get better stats, um, you can just upgrade a weapon that you like. Okay, so we are going to... This is our loadout now. Let's just look through... Our melee. We've got daggers... Hawkbrand... I really like this sword just because of the critical hit. And the echo. Look at that. <laughs> look at that. 1,000... We have exact... Hold on. Let's look... Exactly 1,000 emeralds. Perfect. Um. These are cool because they're 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 rapid fire, so they go pew pew pew. pew. I'll show you. Um, and this armor is good. Artifacts. Actually, let's select some cosmetics. And let's get let's get the baby chicken. That is a giant baby chicken. Alright, here is the rapid crossbow the rapid crossbow. This 
There's a thing called an auto crossbow, and it just gets faster and faster as it shoots. So that's the next bow that I want to get. Let's check this guy. We've got more stuff. Gives you thundering arrows. Hmm. So here we can upgrade an item. Actually, let's check our items right now. And I'm going to use, even though Even though that artifact is better. Mm, never mind. So let's upgrade something. Let's upgrade this one. So after you complete three missions, that one will be ready. Oh, um, I found this emerald chest over here. Fifty emeralds. Okay, next. Let's do pumpkin pastures. Let's do a difficulty higher than we can do. Because then we'll get better stuff. And also I want it at least a little bit challenging. <laughs> Not, not like this game isn't challenging. The is. Illager <laughs> raids have roasted this once lush land to ruin. Only one village remains unspoiled in this corner of the world. Make haste, hero. You must warn the villagers there of the battle to come. You are their only hope. <laughs> There's a few villagers walking in place. These little things flying at me are called souls, and there's these artifacts that I have that require souls. So, uh, I'll show you what they do. Okay, that's the corrupt beacon.
And here is the harvester. Insane. <laughs> Let's go onto the boat. Oh. And here is our villager friend, the mystery merchant. And I'm stuck. Okay. And now we can go to Arch Haven. Let's go back. Let's backtrack a little bit. Oh, they used to. It used to be whenever. Uh, so you would throw TNT. So you can throw TNT, right? Uh, it used to be that whenever you had multiple TNT, it would throw all of it. But now it throws each individual piece of TNT. Oh, that skeleton shot my dog right in the face. So many sounds and things on my screen. Pause real quick. I'll be right back. Continue. Where am I going? <laughs> uh, ah, this is where we're going. That music is a creepy.
huh. All right. Interesting. That was kind of worthless. I'm going to take another pause real quick. I kept shooting that slab. I wish you could import your own skins into Minecraft dungeons. That'd be cool. At least on PC. I don't know why I'm like clicking so much with my mouse. I really don't need to, but <laughs> I do anyway. Um, mm, by the way, that's a door. Um, if you're on adventure mode instead of normal mode, uh, there's a button right here. Click it, you'll get a rune for the secret boss. <clears throat> Well, uh, once I do adventure, once I... You have to beat the Arch Elliger in order to go into adventure mode. So, after you do that, 
We'll also go through and complete adventure mode. Not not complete adventure mode. Complete um the secret boss. Dodged. Yeah, wait a minute. Secret back here. Uh, not here yet. Over this way. Hello. Hello. There we go. Alright, this is where you're gonna find the second eye of Ender. You know, the first one was like the spiteful eye, I think. All of them have names. Why? Oh, uh, that was the biggest combo of all time. I got stuck in the spider web, and the guy summoned the illager summoned a tower over here and blew me up. There's a chest. Is this the chest? Where's the chest? Is it? Oh. Oh yeah, you fight the Enderman over here. Fight him here. Uh oh, my dog died. That is a that's a big problem. Okay, we'll have time. That is the wrong Enderman. That's the wrong type of Enderman. That's the there's two of them. There is two of them. There are two Endermen. Did I blow him up out of... I, I blew him out of the teleport. How? Okay. Yes, floating fire. <laughs> Let's explore this area a little bit more. There's a chest. Oh, no, there isn't.
that critical hit sound is just so awesome. There's just a chair on its side here. Minecraft Championship, two of them. Oh, I killed Minecraft Championship. This music. Oh, it did that. Ah, oh, yes. This is where we fight the big E-man. Look at that. There's void. Void corruption or whatever. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Alright, that was... That was good. <laughs> Oh, did I just bait him? No way. I can just shoot him. Nope. I just... Well. Oh, okay. Mmm, bad idea. He could teleport. You know what? I... My dog is dead. He was a distraction. Oh, uh, he has a critical hit. Okay, I almost got absolutely destroyed. But there you go, we got the second eye vendor. Uh, now where do I go? Okay, I go up here. Over here. You jumped. Those are dirt slabs. Those are rocky dirt slabs. Why isn't that in Minecraft? Rocky dirt slabs. Oh, dang it. I just... <laughs> That's so you can just see the void inside of there. It's like corrupting the ground. You stay inside of there. Okay, I'll take damage. Alright, 
right, there we go. Now, let's save the villagers. Technically, you could play this an entire game one-handed. Because you can click over here. Oh wow, that is a lot of... That, that TNT did nothing. chest over here? Oh, there is a chest over here. Where's my dog? I just exploded the creeper. <laughs> the irony. Oh, okay. That's that is a lot of creeper dam damage. <laughs> that creeper wasn't even enchanted by an enchanter. He was just enchanted. Forgetting that I have a roll attack to where I can just fire. <laughs> he just died from the fire. Look.
Oh no, wait, I'm realizing that's an entrance to something. Did the dog die? No, the dog is still here. Critical hit the cow. Okay. All right, see ya. <laughs> see ya, duel. That was a poor TNT throw. again. Why is the camera so far zoomed? That is a lot of enemies. That is a lot of enemies. That is a lot of enemies. Uh, I forgot what button everything was. Hmm. 
It's fine. We're good. You did it. And the villagers of the pumpkin pastures go on to fight another day. Awesome. Alright, well I think I'm going to end the stream here. Um uh, I might stream later today. Probably not though. Um I might stream tomorrow. I think I'll do that. Oh yeah, we saved the mystery merchant and of course that lantern is floating and so is that tablecloth. At least his placemat isn't floating anymore. His eyes are glowing. Of course, of course they are. Look at that. Why doesn't why don't his eyes glow? It like makes sense for his eyes to glow. Uh, we're going to look at the mystery. Let's see. I don't exactly know how I'm ranking up. It's kind of weird. Check the village merchant. Huh? All right, let's check all of our items. So we got a bunch of new melee weapons. We'll probably use this. Ranged weapons, longbow, longbow. We'll probably use this one. Armor, yeah, probably this one. Fifty-six, thirty health. Yeah. I think there's emotes too. Um, oh, I had it. What do you? What button do you press for emotes? Key bindings. Root player slash elytra dive. What? Look through these real quick. Huh? Chat wheel T. Oops, that is the wrong button. You can press L to fire a bow shot.
Oops. I don't know. I don't know what the em <laughs> how to use emotes. All right. Uh, well, that's the first stream, and I will edit this down into a video, and that will be the first episode. Uh, maybe tomorrow or next Saturday, I will live stream again, and we will probably get through two or three levels, maybe four levels. We'll definitely get through Soggy Swamp and Cacti Canyon. And then we'll probably do Fiery Forge, whatever this is, uh, the temple. And then the next episode will be these. And maybe something else. I'm not sure. Anyway, that's going to be it for this stream and this video. Uh, thank you for watching. Um... If you were li if you were here live, which there was one person, I don't know if he's still here. I don't know if you're still here. Um, never mind. <laughs> uh, if you are, if you were watching this live, or if you're watching the VOD replay either on Twitch or on YouTube. Subscribe to my YouTube channels, the VODs, and the main one. And also follow me on Twitch. I also have a Twitter as well. Uh, that's it. So thank you for tuning in and watching. I will see you in the next stream video. See ya.